speak against me and I was the song of the drunkards but as for me my prayer is unto thee O Lord in acceptable time O God in the multitude of thy mercy hear me in the truth of thy salvation deliver me of the mire and let me not sing. Let me be delivered from them that hate me. And out of the deep waters let not the water flood overflow me. Neither let the deep swallow me up and let not the pit shut her mouth upon me. Hear me, O Lord, that loving kindness is good. Turn unto me according to the multitude of thy tender mercies and hide not thy face from thy servant. For I am in trouble Hear me speedily, draw nigh unto my soul and redeem it, deliver me because 
dust of my nails. Thou hast known my reproach and my shame and my dishonor. Mine adversaries are all before thee. Reproach hath broken my heart, and I am full of heaviness. And I looked for some to take pity, but there was none. And for comforters, but I found none. They gave me also gold. They gave me vinegar to drink. Let their table become a snare before them, and that which should have been for their welfare. Let it become a trap. Let their eyes be darkened that they see not, and make their loins continually to shake. Pour up an indignation upon them, and let thy wrathful anger take hold of them. Let their habitation be desolate, and let none dwell in their tents. For they persecute him whom thou hast smitten, and they talk to the grief of those whom thou hast wounded. At iniquity unto their iniquity and let them not come into thy righteousness. Then be blotted out of the book of the living, and not be written with the righteous. But I am poor and sorrowful. Let thy salvation, O God, set me up on high. I will praise the name of God with the song. Thanksgiving, this also shall please the Lord better than an ox or a bullock that hath horns and hoofs. The humble shall see this and be glad, and your heart shall live that seek God. The poor and despised, not his prisoners, let the heaven and earth praise him, the seas and everything that moveth therein. For God will save Zion and will build the cities of Judah, that they may dwell there and have it in possession. The seed also of his servant shall inherit it, and they that love his name shall dwell.